Hello, this is Roxanne Meadows with Jacques Fresco with me here in Venus, Florida at the Venus Project in the United States. We wanted to welcome everybody at the Echo Life Exposition where Pangea is participating. Pangea is representing the Venus Project. We invite everyone to look at the exposition and learn more about Pangea. These are crucial times all over the world. There are problems in almost every country. We feel it's going to get worse. You've been hit hard in Greece. But people are protesting and wanting change, but they really don't have a direction, a definite direction to change towards that isn't unlike what already exists. We feel that the system itself that people live under and especially the monetary system creates many of the problems that we're facing today. We are introducing a new system called the Venus Project and Pangea represents the work of Jacques Fresco. We ask people to look at the venusproject.com and pangea.org to learn more about a sustainable direction to work towards. And this is for everybody. People all over the world need to know more about the Venus Project. The Venus Project offers a life without war, without unemployment, without discrimination of any kind. It calls for the joining together of all nations into a resource-based economy where all the resources of the world become the common heritage of all the world's people. We feel if we don't move towards that direction, there'll be the same problems, booms and busts, crime, wars over resources. The resource-based economy uses no money. It makes goods and services available to everyone without money, barter, credit, or servitude or debt of any kind. We could create abundance all over the world if we reorganized our technology and the way we run society. It is not money that we need, it's access to the necessities of life. And with our technology used intelligently, we could manage that. We wish to thank all of you for the effort you're putting out to make the Venus Project known to most people. Thanks again. Thank you, Pangea.